Hi guys, it's Gabby. Today I am going to be doing a mini birthday haul slash talking to you guys about my 20th birthday and how it went and everything. I don't really know what to title this video, but by the title of it, you guys would have already known. I actually wasn't planning on filming a video today, but I am because my entire like end of the month videos got kind of messed up and I'll explain it. So basically, you guys know that I post twice a week every three to four days. I had a lot of videos planned for the end of the month of March because it is my birthday month. So I really wanted to come out with some great videos. The first one was the birthday prep, which I did post right before my birthday. I will link that down below if you guys haven't seen it already. And then the second video that I was gonna post was gonna be like what I'm wearing for my birthday. So it was gonna be like a morning and nighttime OOTD so it was gonna be like my morning outfit or brunch outfit and then it was gonna be my nighttime outfit and then I also had another video planned I wasn't gonna do a birthday vlog only because I never do birthday vlogs I'll never vlog on my birthday I mean I don't know in the future maybe I might but now I never have because I just like to enjoy my birthday and not focus on like having to film because although I love making videos I also consider it as a job a little bit making sure that the angles are good and I'd rather just not focus so much time on my phone and rather just be in the moment so I had a lot of other videos planned actually I think that might have been it just the prep the outfit video I wanted to do a haul and I wanted to do another birthday video but I can't think of it at the moment but it doesn't matter anyways what ended up happening is I was gonna film all of those videos uh, the day or the two days before my birthday my anniversary is the same week of my birthday so my anniversary with my boyfriend is March 22nd and then my birthday is March 25th last year because of the pandemic and everything my boyfriend and I didn't get to to do anything for our one year anniversary. We weren't even together, which really, really sucked because you know of everything going on. And then the same thing happened with my birthday. I couldn't see anybody, I was stuck at home. And so it really, really sucked last year. And so this year we wanted to do something really special for our two year anniversary. And so we decided to go to the city. We wanted to go to New York, Soho. It was beautiful. If you guys wanna check out those videos, pictures, all of that, it'll be on my story. What I like to do is in the moment, I'll take like a boomerang or a photo and then I'll save it to my phone and then I'll post all of them later. I do that all the time instead of just sitting there putting emojis and stuff. So I just do it like later. We're supposed to stay one night, but we ended up staying two nights. And so the second night that we stayed was a day that I was supposed to get all of those videos done. It was a day that I was supposed to take my photos for my birthday it was the day that I was supposed to get all my homework done but because we stayed an extra day I didn't get to do all of that obviously I had no problem staying and I'm like okay it's okay I'll just get it done the day before my birthday but obviously I was avoiding that so I wouldn't have to rush so god forbid I needed another day I had the day before my birthday because we stayed an extra night I had a Wednesday to literally get everything done and we didn't end up getting home from the city until maybe like three four ish and so I literally you guys had to get a bunch of homework done clean my room unpack do all of that and then I took photos for my birthday so the photos with the balloons I took those literally at nine o'clock at night yeah so as I was saying because I was rushing I didn't have enough time to film videos that day because I was too busy trying to do my homework unpack just get settled and take photos for my birthday so that is why I didn't have a video to post uh, the day after my birthday because I didn't film it the day of um, or the day prior and you know me I always get in my head saying oh my god I'm a day late but it is what it is it was a really crazy week but it was honestly one of the best weeks that I've had in a really long time I got to spend two days in the city for my anniversary with my boyfriend so we spent the 22nd together and the 23rd and a little bit of the 24th and then the 25th was my birthday obviously and I had a, such an amazing birthday I'll quickly explain and throw up some like you know boomerangs and stuff like that that I took the day of woke up around nine o'clock and I got a massage so my parents get massages at Massage Envy and my mom gave me one of her massages. She gave me an hour and a half. My appointment was at 10 o'clock. So I drove to my massage appointment and it was so amazing. I've gotten massages there before and they are just incredible. So I had an entire room to myself and I had an hour and a half massage. She was amazing. I got the woman that does my mom and so she was great. And then once my massage was over, it was about 1130-ish. So I got home. By the time I got home, started doing my makeup. I did my makeup to go out for brunch with my boyfriend and the one thing that I really wanted this birthday to be is I wanted it to be so chill and that's what it was you know I woke up I got a massage and then I just came home I wasn't in a rush I got to listen to music while I was doing my makeup I did my hair got my outfit together took a nice photo of my outfit so I'll show you guys 
the outfit that I wore on my birthday. Once I was done getting ready, my boyfriend picked me up because he had work and he already had taken off two days. So I had no problem waiting for him to get out of work. So I think he got out of work around like one-ish. Went to this really, really cute brunch spot and I got really lucky on my birthday, you guys, because the place closed at three and we didn't get there until a little after two. So I was kind of scared that they weren't gonna take us in, but they did. The food was absolutely amazing. I had a vanilla milkshake, pizza as an appetizer, the best pizza ever you guys like i'm not really a pizza person but it was such a good pizza now i'm gonna get into my first gift so my boyfriend got me this amazing gift I'm like i said this video is going to be a talk through and a haul so the first thing that i got from my birthday was a gift from my boyfriend he gave me this while we were waiting to be seated at the brunch place and it is a ring you guys i'm gonna show you it's not an engagement ring by the way it is a promise ring and it looks like this and it is real diamond so i think he said it's a 0.25 or 0.5 i don't know something like that and it's white gold which i love and i think it is absolutely stunning i don't know if you guys can see if it's like focusing this is what it looks like i cannot stop staring at it you guys like i've never had a real piece of jewelry like this which is insane like oh my god i love it i wore it on my opposite ring finger i think it is so beautiful and i take it off to wash my hands and to shower but i do that with all of my jewelry i'm not the type of girl to shower with necklaces or earrings because i never wanted to get messed up regardless if it's really fake i've never had like a real piece of jewelry before and so this is my first i am so happy he really went above and beyond but that was the first thing that i got I actually had my grandparents give me something as well they gave me really nice cards and some money so i got that as well and then after we had the brunch we drove to my house i did want to get ice cream afterwards but we were so full that we just passed on the ice cream i know me to pass on ice cream i was i was good <laughs> we started watching big bang theory i love this show i actually started watching young sheldon first and then i started watching big bang theory and i never thought that i would ever watch a show like that but he really did put me on after that i got the biggest surprise from my parents a brand new car when i turned 17 i just got the car that my dad used to drive i had a childhood car growing up it was a blue toyota highlander and that was my childhood car we would use that car whenever we would go to family events all of that that was like our car i remember being a kid sitting in the back of that car and little did i know that that would be my future car my dad gave me his car and he basically got a new one him and my mom have leases my dad has a 2021 toyota highlander and my mom has a 2021 bmw that is a car that i've had it's so old it's as old as i am it's a great car because it really is a great car and i'm really thankful for it the only thing that kind of sucked is the radio doesn't work and it's static so if you want to listen to music you can't my hazards also don't work which sucks and yeah so just little stuff like that that really doesn't work you know the brakes are not not very good the windshield wipers aren't very good but aside from that the car is great and it's been well taken care of it's just you know old i think it's 2003 so it's almost as old as i am because i was born in 2001 i knew that i was going to be getting a new car because my brother is about to get his license and so he's going to be getting that car and so i knew that i was getting a new car i just didn't know when my parents asked me what i wanted but i'm not really a car type of person i all i said was that decent looking and i just want a working radio like it really doesn't matter to me I wanted black interior because they were hounding me for what i wanted so i just gave them i told them that i wanted um black or dark gray i did not want white interior because in my old car i had cream interior and it just got messed up over the years especially with us as kids you know spilling stuff and so it just gets really dirty and so i wanted it to be black and i was so happy you guys have no idea so i ended up getting a toyota rav4 2021 which is insane you guys i have a touch screen the radio works the hazards work it's beautiful i have a backup camera oh my god i'm so thankful if you guys want me to do a car tour let me know because i think i might do that i've never done that before but i've never been like excited about cars because i've always just been like oh like it's a car like whatever but now i'm like wow like i have a nice car and i'm so thankful for my parents that they did that after i got the car my grandma came over and she wanted to see me in person and she also got me a little something so i'm going to show you guys what my grandma got me really cute robe and pj set it's so cute look how pretty this is you guys so let me try my best to show you really cute 
dark blue PJ set, some shorts and a really nice shirt. And then it has this really nice robe. She got me that. And she also got me, she got me a card. She got me some money. She gave me her mom. So my great grandma, she gave me her necklace and her earrings. These are the earrings and it just has a matching necklace. It's beautiful. And I love that she does that because she always gives me her mom's jewelry because she knows that I love jewelry and that I really cherish it. She also got me some makeup. So I'll show you guys that she got me a makeup brush which i can always use makeup brushes nail files i got this really cute compact mirror just super cute pink clinique mascara i got this really cute heart picture frame how cute is this ah i love it i love pink and red together and then my parents also got me a little something they each got me a card my brother got me a card my mom and dad got me a card and they also gave me some chocolate my favorite chocolate ever it is the hershey's cookie and cream so I got one from each of them this is what the necklace looks like that my grandma gave me that was her mom's my abuelita so pretty I love it I think it's so beautiful it actually matches what I'm wearing today so after my grandma came over we got ready I put on my nighttime outfit so I'm gonna show you guys what I wore for the nighttime super cute it was all black with a touch of sparkly pink and then we went to Airy Rang my favorite restaurant ever I never get too bored going to Airy Rang and this is also my cheat week because if you guys know I was on an intense diet for for my chronic hives basically i was an all protein diet no wheat no carbs no sugar i did it for a little over three weeks so the week of my birthday was my cheat week and the food was great i always get the fried rice chicken hibachi with noodles that is my go-to order with a pina colada and some vanilla ice cream so that's what i got we got home we cut the cake saying happy birthday and while we were waiting for the cake to thaw we took my car for a test drive so i kind of plugged in my phone you know did the bluetooth thing and drove it around the block pretty much the end of my day so today i had plans with anna Anna and i always do something separate for my birthday last year right before the pandemic hit we went to the museum of ice cream which was great thank god we got that in before my birthday and before everything shut down and this year we went um for brunch so basically i picked her up in my new car we took it out for a drive so that's basically everything that i did for my birthday these are the 20 balloons that i got the day before my birthday i bought these on my own they are rose gold i wanted to get rose gold because for my 17th birthday i got silver for my 18th birthday i I had hot pink last year i was supposed to have gold but i didn't get them because of the pandemic so this year i got rose gold they matched my dress which was so beautiful i'll put up a picture so you guys can see what that looked like my grandma got me this balloon as well it just says happy birthday with a bunch of hearts super colorful and super cute and then anna got me these adorable balloons that are purple and pink i'm about to tape them to my little nightstand here as you guys can see but how cute is this setup i think this is so adorable so these are the balloons that i have and i'm going to keep them up until they deflate because they are so cute and here are the beautiful flowers that my grandma and anna gave me so these are the flowers that my grandma gave me they are beautiful roses they are red and orange how beautiful are these i put them in a vase with some water and that powder that like helps the flowers or whatever and then anna gave me these they are pink how beautiful she knows that i love pink knows me so well so i think these are so gorgeous as well had to put them in a vase right by my window how beautiful are those and let me give you guys a close-up on the ring look how beautiful that is oh my god you guys i literally don't stop staring at it because it is absolutely gorgeous i feel so blessed this year i got literally the best gifts and was surrounded by the best people this is the set that my grandma got me how cute is this you guys i have the dark blue pajama set i really wanted some cute new pj so i'm so glad that she got me this because so i love the lace i think this is absolutely beautiful love this robe how cute is this you guys absolutely love this she did so good picking this out and yeah i'm about to show my mom what this looks like this is the set that my grandma got me okay you guys that is the end of this video like i said i wasn't planning on filming today i just wanted to end this video by saying i have felt so blessed this year last year my birthday sucked and yeah i know i keep repeating that but it really did suck but this year was so amazing and it truly made up for the year before it was so relaxing so chill i wasn't rushing i got to spend it with the people that i absolutely love got to see my friends after and before and it was just amazing this week has been incredible from my anniversary to my birthday to hanging out with my friends after the fact it's been so beautiful so many great outfits i'm obsessed i cannot believe it my nails as well how beautiful i love them i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you haven't comment down below what you thought about it and subscribe to my channel i love you guys and i will see you in my next video Mwah. bye